starting off in Chetwin, which what started out as a routine traffic stop has spun way out of control. Thursday afternoon, a commercial vehicle safety enforcement officer pulled over a logging truck on the side of Highway 97 and then issued a traffic violation for driving without a, a proper license. The driver of the truck explains what happens next. Yeah, my name is Don Schrede. I drive logging truck here in Chetwin, B.C. and. Uh, Yesterday on my last trip, about 10 o'clock in the morning, I'm coming in from where we get logs and off the mountain and uh, coming into Chetwin and the DOT pulled me over um, at the welcome sign. And from that second, it was unprofessional. They didn't pull my truck far enough off the road. Um, they left it sitting out close to the highway. And when you've got the whole pullout, why wouldn't you not pull it into the back of the pullout? Okay, so anyways, he checks my truck over. Basically, they find very little wrong. Um, and I'm out. It's all over. They're talking. I'm talking to an officer, three officers at the back of my truck. I observe a logging truck coming at us from down the highway, and I see the back tires of it lock up. I realize now that somebody's trying to stop this truck or there's somebody in the road, there's an obstruction, this guy's got to stop. He touches the brakes, it's so slippery, his back tires lock up. The, the highway is built so that the center is high. That trailer is coming to the low point now because it's skidding. That's where we are. Um, I come as close to dying as I ever did yesterday. Something has got to change here because this is just going on and on. It never seems to get any better. What does every construction company on this road need? Flaggers flag people. You need to warn the damn people that you have to slow down, this is happening. Not only that, where was the sand trucks yesterday? They come out after the accident. DOT knows they're going to be there. Phone the people with the sand, get the sand on the road before they get there. It was so simple. A witness on the scene then describes the chaotic scene. The Department of Transport set up a inspection west of town at the Welcome to Chetwin sign and the roads were glare ice and they pulled one truck in and when they went to pull the next truck in they slid into each other and had a wreck. Now I'm just I got some concerns and wondering if you're going to do that on a day like today when it's glare ice roads, would you not have got a hold of someone, CRS or a contractor, to go sand the roads prior to setting up so that you would not have an incident like that? And why wouldn't you put up signage? Because everybody knows that the truckers are, use radios and as soon as there's a DOT within 100 miles, everybody knows it. So set up some signage to warn them that uh, we'll be pulling them in there. You know, everybody else that does something on the highway or on the streets has to adhere to WorkSafe BC and have signage and flaggers and proper uh, proper setup. So I don't understand why they would be any different than anyone else. When originally contacted, the Ministry of Transportation was not aware of the accident and then upon second confirmation, they refused to comment until all the facts were reviewed. When asked about protocols about officers entering the road on foot and road conditions, the Ministry again decli declined comment until the matter was reviewed, saying they didn't want to speculate.